The, the plants are so similar to what would be existing normally that the United States Department of Agriculture said, we will not regulate gene edited plants as genetically modified plants because they're so similar. So that means that you can modify fruits and vegetables and you can get them to market really quickly. So this is the three main objectives to apply the post-harvest technologies to the harvested fruit. The first one is how we can maintain the quality of the fruit. Because after we pick up the fruit, it keeps going, it continues changes. So for us, for post-harvest technologies, this is the main thing that how we can maintain the quality. So I try to use this one with my pineapples. So this is a, another research using this compound in order to reduce the chewing injury in pineapples. Still cool? Is that all right? <laughs> yes. I would like to maintain your quality. You see close <laughs> <laughs> I have one query. Uh, pineapple is a non-climatic fruit, right? Yes, this one non-climatic fruit. Non-climatic. Um, I just still remember my name. I'm sure. No, if you can remember, you would be very, very clever. <laughs> um, my name is um, An. 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 Okay. Um, easy to remember. Um, I will be with all of you uh, during the film clip. Ornamental plant, and I also have a course for the uh, or student in uh, this university uh, as a free repeat course. It, uh, the name is Growing Plant for Architect. Uh -huh. uh, uh, for this course, I uh, uh, let the student <coughs> to do to study or practice about the. Uh, no rain, but might be climate change, or we have uh, some weather change, so it's quite weird that we found a uh, rainy season, rain in the uh, winter season. Okay, first of all, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Sawopha Chaiwo, you can call me Nai, N-A-I, Nai. My nickname is Nai, it's quite short. Okay, today I will give a presentation and we will share that. In the morning session, we have done some management for the ornamental plant, right? And uh, fresh fruit and vegetables. For cereals and legumes, uh, the practice is different. Because we deal with the uh, different structure and nature of the produce. Oh, are they <laughs> get better now? Yeah. Oh. Uh, I've uh, taken some it. sugar. Sorry? Say we have, we have taken sugar and then now we... Okay, we'll now. <laughs> That's good then. So, um, we have some cereals and legumes. Uh, this one is uh, Nutella. 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 Have you experienced on the non destructive evaluation? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Any idea? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, non destructive ah. technique. Okay, on the ultrasound? Yeah. Acoustic. Acoustic technique. So that, that means you already used. No, I didn't. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah, I saw a lot of pictures. <laughs> so, and I'm genius <laughs> for the fresh fruits, fresh don't food. Be, don't be. Don't be. <laughs> come next time. It's not delicious. Because the naughty guys, very difficult to control. <laughs> <laughs> so, the staff will come to collect maybe later, okay? So, we'll leave you. 
to talk and discuss with you. Uh, it's not a lecture, but yeah, maybe just like a discussion and share the experience about the packaging in Thailand that we normally use for agricultural produce, and maybe we can discuss with you. So today we will talk about the applications of packaging for agricultural produce and. This is my full name, really full and really long. My name is Wirong Rong. Wirong Rong. And my recent name is Tong Di Sun Thong. It's not quite correct. <laughs> <laughs> So good morning again. Good morning. Good morning. Long time no see. About one week. Then yes. I haven't seen you. So how are you? Fine. Oh, fine. Right. So how's your trip? Very good. Very good. Nice, right? Yeah. Emily, I just see Jeanette because you went there with the night. I would like to share. Actually, I do hope that many of you already know about the health properties of fruit and vegetable. However, I would like to share a little bit in um, in my experience and also what happened in terms of Thai fruit and Thai vegetable. And later, maybe you can share um, about the situation in your country or which kind of fruit and vegetable that um, you normally have it and is a good source of balancing power. In the afternoon, we will uh, ask you guys to do some assignment and present later, okay? So uh, in the morning, I heard that I will inform you some, a little bit about the more process. So I would like to um, give you or share you more internal uh, information about the more process, but for my part, I'm going to focus on what we call a conventional process. And for the novel process, I will going to continue. Uh, yeah. I give lecture on food chemistry on quality control and quality excellence. And that is my bachelor degree from Chiang Mai University. And finish my master degree from Wakhen Ken in the Netherlands. But now I'm waiting for do my PhD exam from point nine in Germany. But I'm not sure when. <laughs> Waiting for my supervisor to uh, make appointment. We have to look at characteristics of agricultural products. Why we need to implement food safety and quality safety. Because agricultural products are collectible. Uh, lapid lubricate due to its own degree uh, and microbiology contaminant. So you have to make sure that you add something like biotic compounds into your fermented products. Um, so today I will going to talk about um, the type of the fermentation and also at the end I will talk about, about a little bit the research and development in the local fermented food in Thailand. Mostly <laughs> that ready. Uh, so I guess it already one week gone, right? You still have a week left? So almost this week can be lecture in the class as well as like uh, some experiment that uh, you will see. And the parts of the our school, actually we have two program, the two major program, right? Both our technology already done for one week, including with like a side visit. So this week gonna be related to processing. Or uh, in our uh, school, we divided this is like a program of food science technology. So almost this week gonna be related to that. Okay. So having all of the post survey right now, you know, I think that's it. Mm, a lot of information. As well as the side visit, you gain uh, more experience, like a chapter in the book. So the two chapters already upload in the in the right. Okay. So today is probably the last day for the lecture class, isn't it? Yes. Okay. 
good luck for you. That is, that is, after this, it, it's only your assignment, your workshop, right? Because then we, we're going to give the presentation of your assignment, isn't it? On, on Tuesday, next Tuesday, right? Group assignment presentation. And you have one more day on Monday, like a, to prepare yourself for the assignment. We keep a talk on Tuesday, okay? And this is uh, not the last lecture, but it's my responsibility, the, the, the last part of my response. Okay, and we will see again in the next few days the uh, uh, group assignment presentation. Okay, so, uh, have been known, that's it. Uh, agricultural product or food processing that produce a lot and some kind of material just so that you can use it only 30%. So for the content today, I'm going to talk about the, the, what is tea. I think all of you know what is tea. Okay, in China, we have two kinds of tea leaves. Uh, this, the first one, the Chinese one, it will be smaller. And need very good care for uh, but this, but this for not good growing. Materials. Materials. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the tilies, they supposed to be uh, the best ones are on the top yep. and the small. Yep. Oh. Like uh, not, not the big one. Yes, this is not good. So you brought us the the worst. Because it's not the good time <laughs> yeah. for yeah. 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 Okay. Because normally this part mm. to be longer. Well, maybe like this. Mm. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. The part should be longer mm. than this. Bomb so bomb bomb is to start release. to activate the enzyme activity by plus right. So this one is control. If you want to try, you can mm -hmm. press it. Press it? Press it? Yeah. Okay. And do you know that different kinds of tea can make from the same mm -hmm. from material? Yes. But it depends on the processor. Mm -hmm. If you change the processor, the test will also change. Yes. Mm -hmm. These three kinds of tea made from the same raw material. Yeah. You can try it. This one green tea, red tea and black tea. This one, this one is red, red tea. Hmm? Red tea, red tea. Red. Red. This one is red tea, green. And this is yellow. Yellow, oh, okay. Yellow. Yellow. And for hmm. the... This one is semi-permanent. Yes, semi. Semi-fermented. Yes. And this one is the pickle tea, the fermented tea leaf. You can also try. You can chew it? Yeah, you can chew it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I will. You should try. Just like pickle? Yeah. Okay. Pickle is a lactic acid. Lactic acid material. Yeah. But it depends. Uh, the longer time you ferment it, it will be more sour. Okay. But at the beginning, yes. it will be um, slightly astringent. Yeah, this is the specific smell. <laughs> 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 yeah, I know. Yeah, it looks yeah. <laughs> You know that professor Anything? asked us. <laughs> <laughs> Do we look out? <laughs> Which one? But in the past, that? people chewing that uh, after lunch mm. or after meals to clean their mouth, mm -hmm. and because the tea contains fluoride, you can prevent from the tooth decay. Mm -hmm. Just like um, chewing gum. Mm -hmm. okay. It's uh, very famous in the north of Thailand and also in Myanmar. Mm -hmm. Right? Oh, <laughs> have you chewed this? Yes. Lapet, right? Lapet. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah, Same? Or oh, different? The test? Did you try? Yes. You should try. <laughs> <laughs> and also, Southern China, I think try. they also have. Southern China. Yes. Yeah, I mean, North China. It's traditional thing. Oh, really? Yes. It's what? 
Sugar cane, right? Sugar cane syrup, okay. Sugar cane syrup. Eat with sugar cane syrup, okay. To make it taste better. You should try, you should try. This? No, that one. I'm happy. Can you go? No. 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 From which country? Yellow. Many countries. Yellow. China. Kenya. Kenya. Malaysia. India. 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 Nepal. Nepal. Yellow. Nepal. Yellow. Nepal. Yellow. Oh. Taiwan. Oh. Big Tony has. Yeah. But we have not like we have in a in a bag. Yeah. Usually not. Usually not. I manage already put in the bag. Yeah. You put one bag. Because uh, some people love to add this, but some people just eat it with uh, ginger and uh, <laughs> I will show one of my colleagues. What? Me? Yeah. <laughs> Tell them you are very intelligent. <laughs> but you're smiling. Yeah, that's true. What are you doing? What are you doing? Only cheese. Only? No. Yes. That one? Cheese. I cannot do it. I cannot do it. Cheese. 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 Is there any instrument to do this? Yes, we have. We have. Okay. Rolling machine. Rolling machine. Okay. But I cannot bring it. Okay. Okay. Here. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. 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 I saw. In our laboratory. Yes. Yes. That one is more easy. Yeah. Very easy. It is very difficult. Yeah. We have another no, roller. Yeah. 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 Very easily. Yeah. Okay. This is this is Portuguese. This one and then yes, green. Yes. Two hours. Two hours. No, no, no. This one is two hours. How long? How long? This one here. Here. How long? How long? Green between this one and this one. How long? And this one? Ready. 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 Yes, and for many support. Four hours. Okay. For two hours. I'm going to China now. Mix. The online mix, yeah? You can mix. But you should try. Nice slice, but I will not talk about the Before I start, uh, I would like to know who come from the coffee country. From, from, from the beginning uh, until you get the first crab, the end of first crab, the start of the second crab, and then for, for 14 minutes after roasting, it will be like this. You can take it and see it. And mm, okay. Yeah, this one is not good. <laughs> uh, really, this one is the robusta coffee. Mm, the ones that make you sleep. Hmm? The ones that hmm? make you sleep. No, this one not make me sleep. The mm. one that make me sleep is this one. This one from Ethiopia. Oh. Uh huh. Is the wash process. You can open it and then you can smell it. Oops. It's just only uh, less than one week that I open it. And this one is from Thai coffee, uh, but it's the dry process. <laughs> Don't take too much smell. <laughs> For the dry coffee, you can uh, smell some specific uh, aroma, just like uh, the dry banana one. And uh, this one is coffee from Daishang, from Thailand. I have the, uh, this one is the wash process and peabury. This is robusta and peabury. This, no, no, this one is, no. Both this of one. them are the Arabica. 
Robusta is this one. Hmm. So you, Can, uh -huh. so you got pea berry here. Yeah, we have pea berry everywhere. We uh, there are pea berry. Normally, pea berry is just like the immature fruit coffee bean. We we have a name for it. Yeah. It's called caracolillo. Oh, very really difficult to say. Yeah, very difficult to say. Caracolillo. You can see it out. So the pea berry is like this. It's uh, because normally it should be like two beans in one cherry, but for the peabody, you have only one bean inside. And some people think that the peabody is better in quality, but actually the uh, producer screen the peabody out because the size That's is too nice. small to nice. roast with other beans. Like yeah. for for us, like mm -hmm. it's a very um, like. My grandmother was mm -hmm. like was raised in the coffee plantation, uh -huh. so um, they would pick strong, up the yeah. coffee and they uh -huh. would have the pea berry uh -huh. and they would take the it for the house. Uh -huh. So it was like a household coffee. I see. So it was years. Uh -huh. like, so she left and uh -huh. she went to the city and uh -huh. everything. So years later, she, she was around eighty something. Uh -huh. I was like, this became popular. And I brought yeah. it to her. Uh -huh. It was like she was a child again uh -huh. because normally yes. now they like they, they yeah. were throwing it away. Yeah. Like in the houses, they would give them, but they throw it away. But then it started That's to be a trend. Yeah, so it's more expensive. Again. So it's more expensive. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's